Hello everyone. If you have tried to control a cheap Chinese RGB panel with an Arduino, you probably had problems where it does not display properly. As the Adafruit library does not work well with these displays that have 1x4 scan. Root from Arduino forums had modified the library to work with these panels. But it did not work for me. It needed very small modifications. So I have modified the library to work with these Chinese P10 panels. Before that, if you need help connecting the panel to your Arduino, this is the wiring diagram. This is for the Arduino Uno. There is a detailed guide on this on the Adafruit website for the other boards. Download the library files from the link in the description and paste them in your Arduino installation folder or inside your project folder. Then you can use the RGB matrix library with these 1x4 scan panels. But there is a small change in the code when declaring the panel. Like shown here, there is one extra argument at the last, which is the number of panels hooked together. If you have only one panel, put one here and so on. And remember for Arduino, always have the double buffering to false. If this library does not work for you, try downloading Roots version directly and using that. It might work for you. I have linked it in the description. If you upload this code, you should get the display like this. Now let's upload the example code Plasma from the examples menu and see if it works. Remember to change the buffering to false and add the number of panels argument here. Then let's upload it. Finally, you will also need to install the Adafruit GFX library if you haven't already to run this library. If you run into any errors, let me know in the comments and I will try to help. If this video solved your RGB panel problem, please leave a like and subscribe.